Hey y'all, uh, it's Paul, uh, Journey Through an Amputation. Um, today is December 12th, so, uh, Monday, um, T-15. Um, I went to today to the hangar clinic and talked to them about prosthetics. Um, the people there, one of them was a patient advocate who had an amputation herself due to an accident. And... Honestly, I was a little nervous going there talking to them about this and about the costs and about what options there are and what to do. And honestly, it was probably one of the best conversations I've ever had with someone someone wanting to take my money. So there is that. Um, so yeah, Hangar Clinic they they did a great job for me. Um, they actually agreed to let me record some of them and talking about this stuff so i'm anxious to do that um they will be at the hospital the next the same day after my surgery to start getting things fixed up and ready to go so on the, the good side i got somebody that's going to do this they said work with the insurance we'll deal with what you got to deal with if we can't get it all covered then we'll do financing or whatever we got to do to get it done a little nervous there because you know what that means that means it's going to cost some money if they got finance but um they also said that they would talk to my family my wife my kids um help them through this process too so that's good to know the, the bad part about what they tell me is that from what i understand and this is the way i understand it, after surgery it takes four weeks to get your nub to heal once they get that healed then they fit you for the prosthetic now that prosthetic they're all custom made so it's going to take eight weeks to get a uh, new leg all i want for christmas is my new is a new right leg and that's not going to happen it's going to be more like uh easter maybe spring break in the meantime, we'll get by. We'll figure out what we got to do. So, um, it's what it is. Um, but this, the lady did tell me, she said, once you get this done, the pain will not be there. That will be the, the that'll be the most, uh, beneficial thing about this thing, that the pain will be gone. That's, that's a good thing. Um, she did say, and that phantom pain is real. So, as you, she said, it depends on how you handle it, how long you've been dealing with the damage, all kind of... So, there, there's a lot of stuff that I'm going to go through. We're going to learn together because I'm going to show you everything everything I'm going through. Okay? I, my plan is to make this so everybody knows how, how I handle it individually. And that everybody may not be the same as me. Everybody may be tougher than I am. They may be weaker than I am. doesn't matter. We're going to go with this from my perspective and... Um, show you what what goes on. Maybe somebody else has a different experience, but at least I'm gonna put mine out there. Um, that being said, I gotta get ready for my kids' Christmas program. They're having a uh, concert tonight in the at school, and just gotta get dressed and get the kids ready for that. So thank you all. Appreciate you, and we'll talk to you later.